no, no, I'm sorry. I apologize. It ain't going to work. It's not going to do. Sorry. Someone died. Sorry to hear that. Things are rough. Sorry to hear that. Proceed to the route. Yeah. We're done with this. Fuck you. Piece of fucking shit. In hell. So I want to make this video about a channel called The Leets Laws with a Z because he's three, three years old, probably maybe twelve, still watching Fortnite videos and all that shit. So this guy, this guy, his whole shtick is he goes to towns like small towns and shit and harasses police officers and other people just just to get his rocks off, basically. Now I watched a few videos enough to just make me realize what he is and he's a drama queen um it, it's funny it's funny because i know when he's if he sees this he's gonna be like hey you can't talk shit about me huh i'll fight you in a cage i'm a man of law ah i need to don the red glasses and the headset maybe i should hang on wait a minute wait a minute May wait a minute Hang on, hang on, just just give me a second. That's better, that's better. That's way better actually, right? Okay, now I feel like, I feel like I'm able to, you know, do anything I want, uh, harass as many people as I want, because I've got these glasses and headphones on and an iPhone or some shit. I'm just going to harass people. I don't have anything better to do. I also want to challenge you to a fight. Like a legit fight in an arena. This guy keeps on saying things like, in an arena or a cage. Motherfucker, you come to the wrong place. You really have. You came to the wrong place. I don't know how many times you've got your ass kicked. But I'm assuming that, you know, you're one of those guys that's like, Oh, you can't touch me. You can't touch me. You can't touch me. I'm going to call the cops. At the same time as he's like, defund the police. The police are corrupt. If somebody backed him up in a corner and tries to, you know, call his bluff, this is guy's going to be running like a bitch. It's true. It's true. This guy is. His videos are just annoying as hell. It's like, like the way he shoots his shit. And I'm not saying I have better meat. You know, I don't shoot that good. I'm not that great. I only get eight views per video, maybe. I've been doing this for 10 years. But it's funny because this guy, you know, <laughs> and I, I've seen a lot of people talk about it. Like, he goes and he talks about all these, like, you know, repeat offenders, like, some of these people that's fucked up on drugs, or domestic violence, whatever. Like, the guy just came here to start shit. He doesn't know these people. He says he's for these people. He doesn't know them. He's just one of those anti-cop dickheads that I don't know why he even came here. And you're probably thinking, what? why are you saying the same thing over and over? That's what he does. His whole fucking videos. He'll make the same point 5,000 times. That's his videos. That's what it is. It's like, oh, you're a cop? You're a piece of shit. Fuck you, cop. That's that's his shtick. That's it. You can't take him seriously. It's nobody's taking him seriously. The people he is interviewing, come the fuck on, dude. Come the fuck on. Welcome to Ironton. You know there is fucked up things in this area. We don't need to call it out. We already know about it. Nothing's going to be done about it. But I'm not going to go through and start harassing cops and political figures and. Uh, what is it? The uh, shelters for animals and all this shit. Th this guy, this guy is so great. So great. So great. So great. I, 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 I'm just out of words. One of the things he does, which is fucking terrible, is he'll see a, you know, like on the side of the highway, sometimes see a flag or a cross, um, uh, just kind of there. Well, the guy, what he does is if there's a blue stripe flag, which, you know, if it was the cop or something that's got killed, 
he'll go through these flags and he'll rip them off the thing, uh, replace it with a regular flag, American flag. He's got to stay American because he is a man of law. You got to remember that. He is a man of law and he's an American patriot. Don't fuck with this guy. Anyways, what he would do is he would replace it and say something along the lines of, I can't believe what you've done, you piece of shit. I'm glad you're dead. Oh, fuck you. Yeah, look at me. What a piece of shit. You know what's funny is if he does see this video and he does want to challenge me to a fight, I'm not going to do it. I don't really care. You're not worth it. You're just a pussy with a camera. That's all you are. Just a pussy with a camera. That's it. Nobody likes you. Go away. Nobody does. Nobody's taking you seriously. You're just a big, giant, fat pussy. Wait, maybe I shouldn't say that. Since you're from California, I shouldn't assume that you have a pussy. I'll try not to misgender you. Try not to do that. Sorry, sorry, I'm sorry. You know, I kind of like this whole headphones on the head and the glasses thing. You know, I kind of feel like I need to do this for the rest of my life. I need to go back and forth to every small town and just harass people. Interview crackheads. Interview repeat offenders. That's exactly what I need to do. I also need to go up to the cops' windows, knock on them, and be like, Hey, do you want to fight? Do you want to have an actual legal fight? Like, literally, I want to kick your ass. This guy is funny, man. This guy is hilarious. It's just, like, I'm, I'm again, it's Delete Laws with a Z. Again, he's probably 12 years old. Plays Fortnite. Voted for Joe Biden. Sorry. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. I shouldn't have said that. Oh, God. Oh, my God. I shouldn't have said that. Oh, I just feel the internet is just creeping on me. You can't talk bad about Joe Biden. You can't do that. You can't fucking do that. Fuck off. I'm not saying it's bad if you voted for Joe Biden. I don't really care who you voted for. But this guy, you know, is stereotypical Californian, pretty much. Has nothing better to do. Just fuck with small towns. Nothing better to do. I think it's funny. And I think if we see him on the road or in a restaurant, say hello to this guy. Give him a hug. Just, just let him know you love him. Show the respect. Give him so much respect. This guy is a, a man of the law. This man of the law should be held up high. The upper echelon of great people in this town. This is the best thing that's happened to Irons. Honestly, I think it's funny because, you know, anytime you see things like this, like the drama that comes around in these small towns with like these big YouTuber douchebags trying to get their 15 minutes of fame, that's, which that's what he's doing. I don't understand. I don't know what he does for a living. I don't. I don't really care. I don't care what you do for a living. If this is a way that you make your living, okay, that's fine. I like that hustle. I like your hustle, man. Doesn't mean you're not a giant cunt. It does. That's, you know. Doesn't mean you're a giant cunt. Because you are. You are. I just can't wait to see. The DMs, the messages from you, if you see this video, or on my YouTube channel. I can't wait to see those so I can show everybody how big of a pussy you are. I'm so sorry. I don't even know you. But I can smell a piece of shit from a mile away. And that's what you are. Go home. Fuck off. Just go. You know, I, I, I'm laying down. I'm laying these hands down. I'm not going to fight you. Unless you really, really want to fight me. 
That's fine. I'm not a fighter. You might kick my ass. You might know jujitsu. You might be a top tier MMA fighter. I don't really care. If, if violence is the way you want to sort things out, fuck off. You know, here's the thing. You know, I, I have se severe bipolar depression. I've been suicidal for a long time. You think I'm afraid of you? You think I'm scared of you? You think anybody is afraid of you? Nobody wants to approach you because you're not worth it. You're just going to cry out to the courts, try to get a lawsuit going. This guy touched me. He struck me. What a fucking idiot. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry for the rant, guys. I know I go off on a tangent every once in a while. And I go back and forth because this is funny to me. This is one of the funniest things. I got I to gotta get rid of that. Okay. That's better. I feel better now. Wrong color, anyways. I think they need to be white and wireless. And my glasses. Let's take these off, too. There we go. We take the glasses off. Um, that way I can be more serious about it. Got to be serious, guys. Got to stay serious. Um, yeah. Dude. Fuck off. Like, literally. It's an easy thing to do. Just literally fuck off. Go away. And if everybody ignores this guy, doesn't pay any attention, it will uh, affect his ego. Because this motherfucker has an ego. A big ego. Probably a bigger ego than his dick. Which, he might not even have a dick. Again, I'm not going to misgender you. You're from California. I shouldn't do that. You're a special class of people. Special. <laughs> And before you start going in on me like, oh, you don't like trans people, you don't like females, you're a misogynist, fuck off with that. People know me. People that know me knows I'm not like that. Just fuck off.